All right, Boo, what do we have today? Well, this one took multiple days. Uh, to me, this is the most successful airplane that has ever been built. It's the Boeing B-52 Stratofortress. Um, as the name implies, it was first designed in 1952. Uh, they went through a couple of different designs. The last ones to be built were actually, the airframes were built in the early 60s. Not only is this airplane still in use, it is actually the go-to airplane to this day. Um, this is the plane that we, when we really need to blow something up, we don't go to the B-2, we go with the uh, B-52. And um, it can hold in these, uh, in its bay here, it can hold, uh, oh, about 30 bombs that are uh, Mark 82, 2,000 pound bombs. They're about that big and they, they are on these conveyor belts. And the conveyor belts just run through there and drop them to watch this thing on video drop its bombs is a, just an unbelievable thing. Um, the plane is now thought, even though it's, it's uh, designed in the 50s, they're thinking we're still going to be using this airplane in 2050. Uh, it is capable of going about 10,000 miles on one fill up of fuel. Those are fuel pods out here. Uh, it is, it flies at over 50,000 feet, can go over 650 miles an hour for cruising speed. Um, uh, and is just an amazing aircraft. But the fact that it has been around for as long as it has and will continue to be around is amazing. Crew of five, they used to have a tail gunner back here um, who handled this. Now it's radar guided and the guy who runs the munitions and works that uh, tail gun is up here with the rest of the crew. Um, uh, yeah. Show me a top view. Top view, up here. Um, this plane has also been used, it's, NASA uses it for testing things. The uh, X-15 was dropped off a of B-52. Um, it's just an all-around useful that? airplane. They've got, they've got various uh, satellite links and radar things and radar jamming things all over it. Um, we lost a lot of them in Vietnam, uh, but it's still an incredibly effective airplane. And Show is gonna... me your retractable landing gear. No, the landing gear is not retractable. Okay. Um, the, this is landing gear. It has this unique landing gear where it's, it basically lands on, on these uh, eight wheels that are next to each other. And I've been underneath one and climbed up in the landing wheel with my friend Mark Davern. And these tires are enormous. It's, they're like truck, big giant truck tires. And uh, you just can't believe when you get up next to it how big this thing is. Eight engines, each one's producing about 17,000 pounds of thrust. And it can just, it can run for days uh, because it can refuel in the sky. So, um, you know, go 10,000 miles, refuel, and go another 10,000 miles, and the crew doesn't come down. So, that's it. B-52, uh, the most effective and, and successful airplane, I think, ever built. By the way, to scale, this is about how big those Mark 82 bombs are that are on the conveyor belts inside um, that drop right out of here. So... Um, yeah, it was a big build. Took me a while. Good job, Boo. Thank you. Good job, Dasher, Moki, Sadie.